The changes proposed um, are significant, but first of all, perhaps, what's not changing? What's not changing is weekly collection of food waste. The alternate weekly collection of paper, one week, and uh, paper and card, and tins and plastic bottles on the alternate week. That will remain exactly the same. At the moment, we collect with black sacks every week and we get enormous problems with the sacks splitting open all over the place and the rubbish being scattered in the streets. What we're asking the public to consider is that the weekly collection of black sacks is replaced with a fortnightly collection of the residual household waste, but in a proper container, in a wheelie bin, and that that should prevent the tearing open of black sacks by seagulls in the coastal areas or foxes and other pests in the rural areas. Uh, that is an important part because in doing that and moving to a fortnightly collection, we can retain a relatively economical service. It's all a question of price, really. People may well say, well, let's do this, but let's do it weekly. Yeah, anything can be done if you can afford to do it. That clearly is the thing. The line that we're putting to the public is an affordable option is fortnightly collection of general waste in a wheelie bin. And we're satisfied that that will provide a proper and efficient service for residents of Tendering. To summarise, the proposals that we're putting out to consultation represent a real improvement in the service we're able to offer. We will hope to be reducing the rubbish caused by split bags. We're retaining absolutely the weekly food collection service. Uh, we're also continuing, and hopefully with better results, uh, the uh, alternate weekly collection of paper and card, and on the other week, uh, bottles and our tins. Uh, this is all being achieved for the district at quite a reasonable cost. The consultation that we're undertaking runs for a month until the 16th of March, so make sure you get your views heard by the District Council.